was a minor miracle that the Minnesota Fighting Vikings spent their first two draft picks on offense, offensive line, and quarterback of the future. So you know that Mike Zimmer was just like, got to get me some defense. And he got one in linebacker Chaz Surratt coming out of the University of North Carolina. And he's also a former quarterback turned linebacker like someone else we know. Hmm, weird. Let's talk about the new Vikings linebacker today. 22 years old, 6'2", 229, former three-star recruit from East Lincoln High School. He's also the brother of Wake Forest wide receiver Chaz Surratt. Now, if Chaz wants to come along in the sixth round, we'll, we'll take him. He was initially a quarterback, like we said, at UNC before switching to linebacker and making way for Sam Howell in 2019. Sam Howell might be the first quarterback taken in 2022, but getting ahead of ourselves. Over the last two years, he's racked up 207 tackles, 12 and a half sacks, 62 pressures, cut his missed tackles from 11 in 2020, down from 27 in 2019, his first year on that side of the ball. First team all ACC in 2020. Pro Day ran a 4 5 9 40 and tested solid in agility drills and racked up 20 reps on the bench. Pros, he's a great athlete, explosive for days, and is even more impressive than his testing times on film. He really does pop. Also, he's got that length, has good length, and a frame that could stand to add another 20 pounds. I think you'll see him bulk up over the next couple years. Remember, he just switched to linebacker two years ago. Instincts, got a great nose for the ball, is a big play waiting to happen. Also, the 12 and a half sacks, that's not by accident, man. Is great at playing downhill. He is a, we'll say a diet Micah Parsons. Go with that. And he's also a humble team first dude. How would you like to be a guy? You're starting Division One ACC starting quarterback, and then you step aside and you play linebacker. I love that, man. Cons, raw. Two, two years of experience on that side of the ball. It's kind of like when Anthony DeBar at UCLA switched from running back to defensive end. Pretty insane. Also, shedding blocks. That comes down to size and technique, and both of those can be fixed and worked on. Also, weight. Easiest thing to add in the NFL. Get this kid on 6,000 clean calories a day and bulk him up to 245. I think you'll be good to go. And now, I don't think that the Chasserat pick was indictment on 2024th round pick Troy Dye, who got a couple of spot starts in last season and due to injuries, it was simply too much value at 78. A lot of projections had Chas Surratt in the second round. And ironically, he's a lot like Troy Dye. He's a lot like UDFA Blake Lynch, where a little bit undersized, a little bit more mobility, a little bit more of a coverage linebacker, even though Surratt's pretty raw in that regard as well. So Surratt is a great project. And I think that two, three years from now, once the Zimmers work with him and he's integrated with his defense, Eric Kendricks, Anthony Barr take him under their wing. I think that Chas Surratt could be a phenomenal player and a great starter for the Vikings in a couple years. Right away, we'll see. I think that Troy Dye I think that Nick Vigil, I think that Ryan Connolly, I think that uh, Cameron Smith, Blake Lynch will get a, a shot as well. But I think it'll be an open competition for that third linebacker spot. But Chas Surratt, he's a humble guy. He's going to come in. If he makes the roster, he'll play some great special teams. And maybe he'll rise up. Maybe he'll be that next Eric Wilson with a little bit pe uh, better pedigree at, at being a third-round pick as opposed to UDFA. So I'm pretty excited, man. I'm pretty excited what Chas Surratt is going to be in two years. Uh, but as of right now, phenomenal project. Rate value at 78. Uh, Zimmer got him a defensive piece. Let's go. But your thoughts, Chad Surratt, Vikings take him. Linebacker, UNC, 78 overall. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Post on the Venmo. But until next time, Skull, production value.